G'day! In today's video, I've got a uh, Lenovo ThinkPad T580. And this particular one will be getting a RAM upgrade and a bit of dust blowout as well. That will be happening off camera, but today's focus is to see what we can upgrade in this particular model. Now we have battery number one up here. So we need to get that out of here. Go to unlock, slide out. There we go. And next up from here, we're going to need to use a Phillips head screwdriver to get in there. While we're in there, I do also want to see what can be upgraded hard drive, hard drive wise. I'm going to assume it's an NVMe M.2, but we'll find out soon enough. Now these screws don't actually feel like they're meant to come out. They are getting loose, but they're staying in the plastic itself. Not seeing any extra screws down here. This one at the front here is being stubborn. Next up from here, let's see how we're meant to proceed. Fold this up. I'm going to try and split the seam. A plastic pry tool. This the front here. Have that one screw being stubborn. Put that back down. Continue across. There we go. As we can see, Hard drive wise, one hard drive down here, which is basically got an enclosure or a metal bracket to connect up the M.2 here, which is running to this cable to here. Do our battery number two here. And the dust here is actually pretty darn clean. It's just merely the outside of it. As you can see there. It's a dust brush, we'll sort that out. And we do actually have another M.2 over here. A very little baby one over here. So we're finding that rather neat. Let's upgrade the RAM. I'm going to disconnect this battery here. Pull these tabs back towards me. There. So now we've got no batteries connected. Now from here, actually to show you, these tabs here pull out and the RAM sits up. Pull that out. We have 8 gig of PC4 2400. So not exactly fast memory. I'm going to be combining it with some crucial 3200. This will make it speed run. It, this one here will downclock its speed to match this one. Now, being that this particular laptop has an 8350U in there, an i5-8350, according to the Intel Arc website, this processor only uses up to 2400 MHz RAM. So there's really going to be no advantage with this particular faster RAM being used in this system. But that's what I've got on hand, so that's what I'm going to use. So I'm going to put this into here. I could take note of the markings here to go with the notch. I sit it in the groove, push it down, and then just push down. That should not do that. There we go. So I've kind of had to hold it in as I pushed it down. It's clicked it into place, and we clicked into place there as well. So right now this will be running in dual channel mode. And being in dual channel mode, usually some video games and applications run up to about 10 to 15 percent better. Just reconnected the battery here. And from here, I'm right to put the back cover back on and then reinstall the battery and power it up from there. So with the extra RAM added, you don't have to do any configuration to make that happen. You just simply have to add it. 
push this down. There we go. Go. Screw in the front here. Well, it's being a little bit stubborn and not wanting to screw up. I'll figure that out in a moment. Proceed with the rest of the screws that are happy. So yeah, when you change the RAM, you don't have to worry about doing anything to configure it. You just simply have to add it. And most laptops, desktops, will figure out what to do from there. If it's a desktop computer, you'll probably have to enable XMP to run it at its full speed. That full rated speed. If it's a laptop, you just simply add it in. Push this together. There we go. Now this screw down the bottom here will want to go back in, I'd say. Yep. There we go. So I hope that helps with your RAM upgrade of a ThinkPad T580. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye.